Uh, well, you know, John stays up up to date on all the latest headlines mm -hmm. and even the unique wow. facts that many right. don't know. He is here with another edition of Wicked. Wicked Who. All right, guys, if you need a refresher, it goes like this. I give you three people, famous people, people of note that have something in common. Today, it's their name. And then I give you a semi-obscure factoid from their Wikipedia page, and you have to tell me which one that applies to. Okay. Okay? Okay. okay. Today, guys, we got the Bills. All right? Bills. It is Bill Paxton. Okay. Bill Pullman. Yeah. And Bill Nye, the oh, science guy. Oh, yeah. Good one. This is great. By the way, people yeah. often confuse Bill Paxton and Bill Pullman, so this could be even tougher. Oh, oh okay. okay. As always, if anybody goes three for three, you get the jar of relish currently being guarded by Tommy Lee Jones in the uh -huh. refrigerator. All right. Okay, uh, first of all, ignore the text on this first question. It was late on a Friday when I wrote this. <laughs> so just listen to what I say and ignore the text. Okay. Okay. Which Bill's great great grandfather, not grandmother as it says there, <laughs> timing didn't work out on that, fought for the Confederacy in the Civil War, and was actually a brigadier general, huh, which I think huh. is pretty high up there in the. Uh, I'm my, still, well, go ahead. I was gonna say my brain is flagging Paxton, and I don't know why. It just is. Because he does have a southern accent every once in a while. Is that why? In some of his movies. Okay. Maybe. Yeah. Oh. Like near dark. Oh. A little hint yes. of southern accent. You're right. Right. You're right. vampire movie. Yeah. Paxton. Okay. You go Paxton. What do you think, T? Bill Nye. You go Bill Nye. Hmm. And Courtney, you go Paxton too. Paxton. Uh -huh. Okay. So we got two Paxtons and a Nye. <laughs> Well, guys, Bill Nye might be the science guy, but he comes from a family of warriors. His dad spent four years as a Japanese POW in World War II. Wow. His mom was a code breaker wow. during the war. What? Really? Yeah. Cool. So it would make sense that his great great grandfather fought in the Civil War. Maybe he did. We don't know. It's not in his Wikipedia page. But we do know <laughs> that Elisha Franklin Paxton hey, was a brigadier general for mm. the Confederate Army during the war. And by the way, you're, you're, uh, you're picking up the southern accent. Mm -hmm. Now, it's astute. He's from Fort Worth, Texas. Oh, there oh. you go. Okay. <laughs> so you guys are in the running for the relish. Yes. Tommy Lee Jones is getting agitated. All right. <laughs> Always. <laughs> I was going to say, how's that different? More so than normal. <laughs> All right. Uh, question number two. Uh -huh. Which bill... Got a restraining order oh. against his wife a year after they got married. Oh dear. Oh. I'll say Pullman. I was gonna say I think I'm gonna say Pullman also. I'm gonna ride with Bill Nye the Science okay. Guy. Okay, all right. Going Bill Nye the Science Guy. Mm. Well, guys, you know fame and love both can make you crazy. Mm. So when musician Blair Tyndall broke into her former husband's house and destroyed the garden with herbicide. It didn't really register as one of Hollywood's, you know, most scandalous moments of mm -hmm. between couples. But the fact that her ex-husband was Bill Nye the Science wow. Guy <laughs> made it a little bit strange. <laughs> it's, you know, it's difficult. Once you've, you know, been with a man with a bow tie, yeah. it's tough to get hard to let go. Uh, yeah. Apparently he got an annulment seven weeks after they got married. And he also claimed that she uh, stole his laptop and sent out really... Um, I guess questionable emails in his name. Yes, ah. made him look oh. bad. Oh. Okay. Ain't nobody got time for that. She denies that. <laughs> she admits killing the garden. Okay. <laughs> Final question. Okay. Cody is in the running, and now Tommy Lee Jones is full on Ooh. grumpy. Uh, question number three: Which Bill lost his sense of smell after suffering a brain injury? Oh, this is the second uh, loss of sense of smell. We've had in WikiWho. Jason Sudeikis was the other one. Uh -huh. Is that so, your go-to question now? Yeah, I, I, I look up their smelling ability on every single one. I'm gonna go Bill Nye. Mm -hmm. Pullman. Pullman. He says Pullman. Pullman. Two Long Pullmans relish. and an I. Pullman relish. <laughs> okay. Fine. Well, guys, it's hard to understand how something like that could even happen. Right? How do you hit your head and lose your sense of smell? But you can bet that Bill Nye, the science guy, knows uh -huh. how. He probably could explain it to Bill Pullman, who has not been able to smell oh, since that accident man. when he was 21 so years old. And Cody gets the relish. <laughs> Cody gets the relish. Greatness. <laughs> Tommy Lee Jones is full on peed now. Again. Yes. Cody, I feel like this is like the third time you've you yeah, won the It is my college. third time. Right. Nicely done, sir. What's the expiration date on that? In your victory. I don't know, but we got it from the start of baseball season last, last year. Last year. Yeah, last year. So like around this time last year. Ah. Yeah. All right.
Uh, you enjoy that relish, sir. We'll see you on the other side of the break. Thank you.